I'm Anita with Anita by Design and welcome back to Sewing with Baby Lock Soprano. Today in episode number six, I'm going to show you guys how to thread the sewing machine. Now if you missed last week episode number five where I showed you how to wind the bobbin, go watch that one first and then come back and join me. Let's get started. Okay, the first thing you want to do is turn your machine on. Then you want to make sure that the presser foot is in the raised position and I'll show you why. We're going to follow the number sequence and the arrows on the machine as we're threading. So we're going to start at number one and go down, back up to number two, over to the left, down to number three, then over, shift over to your left and come back up to number four. Number four, there is a wider groove here. And when you, if your presser foot is down, this is what happens. This area is blocked, so you will not be able to continue threading your machine. So just make sure that your presser foot is in the raised position. Then we're going to take our thread, making sure that the thread is unwinding from the bottom going toward the front. Remove your spool cap, place the thread on the spool pin, and replace the spool cap. Then we're going to take the thread with both hands, and starting at number one, we're going to Go behind the thread guide plate cover, down to the bottom, shift over to the left under the thread guide plate, and then go back up to number two. Then we're going to shift over to the left. Following the arrow, we're going to go down in the groove to number three. Then we're going to shift over to the left and go back up. Now, when you're going up in this groove, you're going to make sure that you're leaning your thread over to the right until you get to the top. Then you're going to shift over to the left to go down. And the reason we're doing that is because there is a metal hook inside this groove that the thread is latching to. So continue going down, leaning your thread to the left, down to number five. And from here, we're going to thread the needle. To thread the needle, we're going to slide the thread behind the needle bar thread guide and we're going to pull it to the left until it clicks. From there, we're going to pass it through the notch of the threader guide and then over to the left, we're going to slide the thread under the threader guide disc and from there, we're going to cut the thread. To cut the thread, we're going to move it to the back of the thread cutter on the left side of the machine, then we're going to pull it to the right and the blade will cut the thread. Next, I'm going to press down on the lever for the threader and it's going to automatically thread the needle for me. So I'll give you a close up of the needle so that you can see what happens after I press down on the lever. So I'm pressing down on the lever right now and you will see that the thread that the needle is threaded. Well, that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the like button below. And don't forget to join me next week in episode number seven, where I will show you guys how to change your presser feet and how to change the sewing machine needle. Until next time, remember, when you live in your design, it is from there that God shines. That means when you live according to the way that you have been created, it is from that place that God will use you to bless other people and allow his light to shine through you. Thank you. See you next time. Bye-bye.